Nora fashion. We design this with passion. Nora snaps fashion. fashion. Good morning, afternoon, or nighttime, legend. I'm not sure what time it is for you, but I know that it's time for me to cook. Was that a good intro or was that just like really cheesy? Don't I have a treat for you, legend? I'm recreating a viral recipe on YouTube. It's got over 50 million views. It's one of the most popular cooking channels, most popular video. And it is this eight desserts in one sheet tray. And I have a feeling that this recipe is cap. I don't get how you can put eight desserts into one and for them to all cook evenly. But Tasty said we could do it, so we'll see if it works. I'm not sure which one the sheet tray to start off with. I'm not sure if it's a big one or a little one. I'm not really expecting it to work. Are you? I feel like I just don't expect it to work, especially if I'm doing it. And luckily I have bought cookie mixes, brownie mixes, and I have to make my own brownie recipe because that would take forever. And the ingredients were actually pretty expensive for this, so if you're like sticking to a budget, this is not the dessert for you. It's actually gonna be really hard to follow along because there's just so many things going on. But I mean, all you gotta do is basically is buy a heap of like mixes and then you should be okay. Except for pumpkin pie, I so I've gotta try to make that from scratch. You meant to use normal pumpkins, but I just bought pre-diced ones. Does that sound really bad of me? I don't know, I just don't like pumpkin pie. Perfectly 80 grams of butter. I'm actually gonna have two things going at the same time because I am experienced! I am not excited to do the dishes for this. But I'm gonna do it for you because this is a really good title and hopefully your YouTube time will not be wasted watching this video. And I'm gonna make sure of it. I want you to like, be unentertained on YouTube because I feel like when I go on YouTube, I feel like there's nothing to watch. I feel like I'm talking this up. I'm gonna do the best I can though. 125 grams of melted butter into my brownie mixture, which I bought from the shops, and therefore is not mine. It's Betty Crocker's. So I'm mixing my brownie mixture in. I'm gonna also prepare my cookie mixture too. In this recipe, they actually have two cookies. Cake mixes are so easy. Pouring in the softened butter. And I'm also gonna crack in one egg. I've got a lot of baking to do, and it's just me today. No other Norris nuts were coming because they're pretty busy trying to get other edits out. Okay, I actually have a couple of cooking ideas, which I think might be hard to film, but would be really good content. I think we should do a mama and papa cook-off, every single kid cook-off, and a baby cook-off. And I also want to make a giant hamburger. This brownie mixture looks really good. These two, again, put to the side. I've also got this pumpkin that I need for my pumpkin pie. I've got to make it soft into the oven to make a puree and then just like combine it with a bunch of sugars and that should be fine. <laughs> gonna chuck a whole heap of pumpkin onto my bacon dish. Do you like pumpkin? I'm not a big fan of it. So, so far I've made the two cookie doughs and the chocolate chip brownie. I'm actually gonna start putting the desserts in my pan. So we're gonna have to divide this into eight things. So I reckon like here, here, here. So the normal cookie dough like on this part. So do you reckon that looks like an eight? I'm gonna add the M&M's into my leftover cookie dough. You know what we should do? Cooking in your aesthetic. That looks so good. I'm gonna place a nice big hunk Right here. It's working out really well. It looks pretty good. I feel like I need to add a couple more M&Ms into here. Let's make the cheesecake filling. Do you think I could do a double crack? What's this? Sorry. Oh, I wasn't meant to add the eggs. Oh my god, no. Now we need 125 millilitres of thickened cream. Hopefully it works. No. I've got thick and cream in here and all over the floor. Let's beat this. As long as I'm fancy. Now let's pour in this cheesecake mixture. If you were going to answer, would you say this is turning out good or not that good? Oh, it stinks. I'm gonna have to make the apple pie filling. I've got a peel, core, and thinly sliced apples. They should have just bought pre-chopped ones. How good is that you can just like cook from boxes? Like whoever thought to make a cake mix is a genius. Why don't you just sit there, relax, and listen to some chopping sounds? If you can live anywhere in the world, where do you reckon you'd live? I've never had apple pie to be honest. People say like grandma's apple pies are really good. Can anyone be allergic to fruit? Put some sultanas in there. You can also pour in a little bit of lemon juice. Would not want to get that stuff in your eye. Like, I don't know the measurements for this. Sometimes in life, you need to be adventurous. All I know is that I've got to pour in two tablespoons of flour and also pour in a bit of sugar. I thought that this was meant to turn out a bit more like syrupy. Maybe it's more lemon juice. And I might make it too sour. I'm gonna pour some cinnamon in. Oh, cinnamon smells so good. I'm gonna actually go home and look up what is wrong with this because I feel like I'm meant to use like a juice or something. My apple pie filling is dry, it's not wet. Like it's meant to be wet. Did you follow the instructions? I don't know the measurements for this. I'm just like randomly putting the stuff that 
I need to get into my bowl. It's like turning out so dry. Saber, you have to realize that this is a different recipe from the one you're using. They use like canned apple pie. It's not, this is like not- Well, then how come their one looks syrupy? Because it's probably baked in everything. Oh, so it looks good when it's baked. Well, what, you show me the tasty one you're copying? It looks like that. You're using a completely different recipe. What do you mean it's gonna look like that? That one's canned. Oh, my sister's smart. <laughs> I might be wrong, but like that's what it looks like. Thanks, Zucky. I didn't need Google, I just needed my sister. <laughs> Thanks, I postman's here and I'm like fully just like decked out and like a cooking outfit on the street. Hey. I guess it's not meant to be syrupy like the Americans had it. We're doing this the Aussie way, the dry way. No, I've got the pop <laughs> I'm the biggest idiot ever. Why? I didn't leave this to Thor. Now I'm gonna be lying my tray with the biscuits that are in the cheesecake and the s'mores. Hang out pretty well. If I can do this, I'm gonna be a really good cook. This was meant to be graham crackers, but because I'm Australian, we hadn't saw graham crackers, so we can't make a proper s'more. But I've used these things called milk coffee, are not biscuits. Hopefully it works just as well. That's looking pretty good, if I do so so myself. So now I'm gonna puree my pumpkin. This is I feel like there's so many different things going on. How do you make this work? I feel like I'm making baby food. How is this meant to go in dessert? I feel like I'm offending all the people who like pumpkin, but I feel like I'm not offending that many people because I don't think many people would like pumpkin in, in a dessert. Oh. I've got my pumpkin puree. Place pumpkin sugar, salt, and spice into a saucepan over a medium heat. We need 145 grams of white sugar. This is roughly just measure it, it doesn't really matter. It's just pumpkin pie. <laughs> and spices. We got cinnamon. Cloves and ginger going in. Oh, spices just smell so good. So 330 milliliters of thickened cream. No, I wasn't meant to add the cream. I can't do it again because I don't have any more pumpkin. No, oh my God. And it's like, it's like, oh my God. Oh, and a question. What's the most gnarliest time you've ever stuffed up in a dish? I really want you to like say it in the comments because I really want to read it. I really hope this like yucky stuff just doesn't leak into like all my good stuff chilling over there. I hate pumpkin, I hate asparagus, I hate broccoli, I hate Brussels sprouts. I don't think anyone's gonna eat the pumpkin pie. I've gone through so many bowls. Last dish I've got to make is the banana bread. So excited to finish. Not really excited to finish, but I'm excited to see how it turns out. Wait, I'm meant to add bananas into this? What? Luckily, we always have spare bananas in the Norris house because... So I've only got one banana, I need four, but it's a pretty big banana. I feel like this is the perfect dish to make if you have like lots of friends who like don't know what they like. One quarter of a cup of milk. Got my olive oil, two thirds of a cup. I'm gonna add in my banana. I wonder if this is gonna turn out. What's your bet? I'm gonna assume that all of the desserts, I feel like they had different cooking times, but supposedly to taste you, they don't. Pour that in now. Looking pretty good. And hopefully this has been a good video for you and you've been enjoying it. it does look a little lumpy. There's my banana bread mixture. I'm gonna get my puff pastry. No, it's frozen. I have a feeling it's gonna snap. Oh, well, didn't actually. Oops. This is the best I could really do. This pumpkin pie is really like milky, not thick. I oh, know, it's gonna leak. First up, let's pour my cheesecake layer on. It's been fun though. I've really enjoyed hanging out with you, so thank you if you stayed like this far in the video. And if you have, there's even better coming up. The Norris that's gonna judge my creation. First pie layer is gonna go here. That's the apple pie. I'm trying to like stay really focused, like really concentrating this part. Almost there, just don't stuff up now. This is like part I can't stuff up in. I can do it, I can do it. Now this is actually turning out Really, really good. I just gotta try to get that into there, but I don't know how that's gonna work. I feel like I have to build a like a sturdier wall. Now this is definitely an impressive dish, but don't do it if you're short on time. Oh, that's heaps. Oh my god. <gasps> yes! <gasps> this looks amazing! We're gonna bake that for an hour on 150 degrees Celsius. And man, it looks really, really good. This could work. I've just got to add the marshmallows later because I know they're going to burn after an hour and probably ruin the dish. The best part's right now. One hour is up. Time to take it out. Okay, drop it. Oh. It actually looks amazing, don't you reckon? Do you reckon it looks even better than Tasty's? I don't know how my apple pie turned out. Wow! Oh! It looks it's interesting. Oh, wow! That's really good. That's that looks so marshmallow. good, Zay. Thanks, Zucky. Except for that. That looks really nice. Yeah. <laughs> it really didn't turn out so good. Burning Let's go! So we have s'mores, chocolate chip cookie dough, brownie butter, banana, pumpkin pie, M&M cookie dough, cheesecake, and apple pie. Looks I'm gonna good! I'm going to try the apple pie first. <sighs> oh, it's really wet-ish. Yeah. Looks mm. pretty good. And the pastry is really kind of like raw. Raw! 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 
The pastry tastes raw and the apple just tastes like cut up apple. I think you should replace the apple pie with another um sort of food. Sorry, it tastes a little bit like baby food, like the apple, like yes, yeah, cinnamon. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, no, that's, not, that's, that's probably gonna be the worst one. Pumpkin that's, pie? No, I don't no, want to eat this. Pumpkin pie. You sure? I'll just try it for the legends. Just so no, why pumpkin pie? Because that's why I had to. I had to copy the recipe exactly. How is that a dessert? Like, it smells like scrambled egg. Did you not waste the eggs properly? No. Careful now. If it's good, I'll eat it. But if it's bad. UK. Mm. Yeah, don't, no, no, no. <laughs> it tastes no. like scrambled egg. Which one next? Let's right. try the banana bread. Looks very moist, same. But I can't make it all cook. I fun. think it's so bad for Saber because, like, um, it didn't really work out probably some things are undercooked, some things are more cooked than others. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That tastes like mum. Really? Yeah. Mm. Um, um. It's good, it's not banana enough though, is it? No, I, I it was meant to use four bananas, but I could only find one. <laughs> So now it's just bread. Well, that's why it didn't taste that sweet, I think. Mm. But I love that like, so much. Butter. This is my favorite. I'm gonna taste the butter. No, it sounds like banana. I wanna try the cheesecake. I love cheesecake. I don't know about the cheesecake. The che I have to admit, like, the placing looks very nice. Thank you. Oh. Oh. What's wrong? It tastes really bad. <laughs> oh my why god, that that's really bad. Why is that your so everything's so probably like actually not that good. Except the banana bread. Okay, now let's try the s'mores. Oh, oh my god. 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 This is actually. Oh. The s'mores is legitly really good. Oh my god. It's no. still stretching. Yeah. It's still ah. stretching. This would be a great party food. Yes. Yeah. Don't the pumpkin pie or the cheesecake or the apple pie would be the best yeah, thing. It's pretty much everything we've tasted. Mmm. That's the best one so far? Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh. no, it tastes mm. like a hot chocolate. You like the banana bread more? Mm. Ooh. Good job, Sam. I like the Thank banana you. bread more. Let's it. try this decadent brownie. Ooh. Huh? Mm. <laughs> Look, mum, I mean, it's not chewy. Why well, do you think, if you keep saying this is like mum's food, you're basically calling mum's food box food. Yeah. Oh. So you should not say that. But I have such high expectations for these cookies. Oh my god, that's not crunchy. No, say. <laughs> this taste test thing's gone for Run. a long time. Oh, that's good. That's great. Mm. Good job. Then we just love cookies. I really enjoyed the s'mores, but I recommend cookies. The cookies. <laughs> but that was good. Actually, it deserved for every single um person in our family. Who do you will get skunked with the pumpkin pie? <laughs> oh, but yeah. No one's mm. holding back the cookies. This one's the best one for sure. Mmm. Mm. So, which one's your favourite? That one. <laughs> Lucky last. So, do you reckon the legend should make this a home? Mm -hmm. Don't do the cheesecake, apple pie, or the pumpkin pie. Just do all the sweet ones. Catch me knuckles.